but let me just say something about our local situation. Um, or well, just looking at the interchange numbers, actually the number of cases in the interchange is coming down. Um, say Boon Lay bus interchange, for example, at its peak, uh, which is four days ago, 30th of August, it has 21 cases through our swap ops, through people not feeling well coming forward and get tested. Today is five, so it has dropped 21 to five. Toapayo as well, four days ago at its peak, 20 cases, today is three. Tampines was six days ago, or five days ago, 29th August, eight cases, today is one. So you see that pattern happening throughout the bus interchanges. So the cases in the bus interchanges is actually coming down. But our overall figure is going up, mainly contributed by unlinked cases, so they caught it somewhere as well as cases still pending classification. But these are not cases where through swap ops at the interchange we discover them. And these are cases that is reported and then we are trying to link them. Uh, I think it reflects the fact that our contact tracing, isolation testing at the bus station is working, at the bus interchanges is working, is suppressing the, in, uh, the, the infections. But at the same time, as uh, ministers have said and DMS have said before me, as we circulate more, as we open up, we are seeing more sporadic cases all over the island. So I thought, give this context so that we understand uh, the numbers when we are reporting. Because I, I, I'm mindful that when people see a high number, today 216, they think it's all bus interchange. Actually, it's not. Bus interchange numbers are falling.